Hey everybody, just gonna make a quick video today. I was online complaining about the uh, Yellow Jacket core removal tool not working, and uh, they asked for a video to uh, show how that was going. So I'll show. Here it goes. Start off with the Apion valve core removal tool. New this season also. Tighten her down here. Locks right into the core, no problem. Alright, until she's out. Close the valve. And there's the, the core. Okay, try to put it back in. And she tightened right up. Very nice, that one works good. Let's go to the CND. Also new this season. This one's a little different where it has a gate valve instead of a ball valve. Can be handy if they're having a space constraint there. No room for the ball valve to turn. Feels like it locked in good. Unscrewing nicely. Feel that's out. Tighten up that uh, gate valve. And see if the core's here. There's the core. Okay. Put back in. Open up the gate valve. And reinstall it. Okay, very nice. That one worked too. Okay, so on to the Yellow Jacket. This is the Yellow Jacket uh, 18975. I noticed it does say 2013 right on the end there. So let's try this one. Tighten it up. Grab the valve. You can feel the resistance there. Feel it unscrewing. You can tell you're at the end there. Pull it up, close the valve. Open up the end here. And no core. Okay. Core's not right there. So let's try that again. Let's see if we can put it back in. Yeah, feel the resistance and it's going right back in. So it'll take it out and put it in just to the end there, but that's it. So. Let's see if we can get it by using maybe the uh, the Apion plunger. Luckily these are all quarter inch fittings so we can do that. Okay, it's grabbing. Feel it unscrewing. Got to the end there. Close the valve. Oh, no core again. I try to screw it back in again. Maybe the one from the CND will do it. Usually the Apion will work with it, but today, of course, because I got the camera out, it's not working. Maybe yeah, be better off just throwing that one away and just using the Apion and the C and D.